Hold on, let's put up this picture. I know y'all be throwing shade at him over that chin, but here's the thing. I still hit it. I don't care. Like, I don't care what he look like now. Zac Efron can still get the business. So, according to reports, Zac Efron was reportedly taken to a hospital in Ibiza, Spain, after suffering an incident at a swimming pool at a villa in, as I said, Ibiza on Friday night. Now, a rep for Efron tells TMZ that Zac was taken to the hospital as a precautionary measure after what they describe as a minor swimming incident at a villa in Ibiza on Friday night. They were told that he was released in the hospital this morning. I think it was like... Yes, two days ago or whatever, when I talked about one day, let me see what was the day. Okay, I did this on, um, I think it was, yeah, it was two days ago when the story was first reported. He was released from the hospital. The next morning, he's recovering just fine. Now it says, Afron's been traipsing around Europe for a while with Photogs snapping him in Ibiza, St. Tropez, Mykonos, and Pali over the last month. He also hit the stage with Martin Garrix earlier this week, looking full of life with fame DJ. So yeah, he's been out here partying. He's been having his, living his best life. Look, he did a couple, he's been doing a lot of movies. Like he did the Iron Claw movie. I think he has the, was it Mickey Sinicky, whatever the hell the name of that movie is. Isn't John Cena in that? He's doing that. He's got a couple of movies that he's about to start filming. I think principal photography is expected to begin soon on a Three Men and a Baby reboot. I didn't even know they were making a remake. Ricky Stanicki is the name of the film. So, yeah, John Cena was in that. And, you know, he did the Iron Club movie with Jeremy Allen White. So, Zach out here living his best life. You know, when you act, you, you make a good enough amount of money that you could take trips and do whatever. And they said that he dove into the pool. Dive into the pool. Remember that song, that, that dance track from, um, come on, let's get soaking wet. From, <clears throat> from Queer as Folk. <laughs> the American version. So, he dove into the pool. They said he hit something, or they say he took in a lot of water. I don't like, what is wrong with him? First, when you trip on a pair of damn socks, mess up your chin, bust it open, and then you had to go get, I, I don't know what the hell they did, implant, um, steroid, whatever the case was. Now his face looked crazy. And I don't care how he looked, I still hit it, because that guy from can get it. He, he's still fine. He don't look Mickey Rock crazy, but I still hit it. <laughs> Whatever. I know some of y'all be like, Chris, what the hell is wrong with you? Look, look, look. Zach and Frank can still get it. I don't care what none of y'all say. So they look. The rep was kind of out here saying it was a precautionary measure. They didn't say what it was, what caused it to be in distress. He dove into the pool. He took in water. I'm like, you don't know how to, first, as many as, first of all, he was in the damn Baywatch movie. You don't know how to swim. You don't know how to dive into a pool properly without taking in water. He trips over, slips on a sock and busts his chin open. Then he goes and, and don't know how to dive into a pool. No shade. And you know what? I'm going to say it. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. But I believe drugs was involved. You can't tell me you out in Mykonos and all these other places living your best life and you ain't putting no drugs up in your system. Because let me tell you, I sure as hell would. I'd be drinking. I'd be doing the booger sugar, the the real pure shit. Not that stuff y'all be putting that, um, what is it? I was going to say, y'all going to put Ozempic up in it. <laughs> y'all not the, 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 the Fenty, y'all not going to put that Rihanna Fenty up in there in the booger sugar. It's like, I've been doing all the drugs in moderation, of course, because I'm living my best life. If I'm out partying and dipping it and doing it, you don't think I'm going to be out living my best life? And you cannot tell me that Zach was sober the whole damn time. You're going to be out, I'm going to be out there hunching. I'm going to be out there doing all the drugs and living my best life. You ain't going to see me being no damn prude. So I should say that Zach did release a vague statement. He took to his Instagram and he posted this photo. Looking on find myself. I'm like, damn, even his feet got muscles in it. All them veins up in them feet. So he's up in there, you know, on a medicine ball, lifting weights, trying to keep that body, body. Keep it, give me body. Body, yada, 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 yada. Keeping that body nice and tight, as he should. Because, you know, no, I'm not going to do that. I was about to say something. But y'all, child, y'all already know the tea I told y'all about Zach at the club. <laughs> That uh, a friend of mine seen with his own eyes. If y'all don't know, you better ask somebody. But do I think Zach will ever come out of the closet? I don't know. But I'm like, what's the point? You don't need to. You don't need to hide who you are, sir. 
that you like the boys and the booze. But here's the thing. Like I said, I do believe that, that you know, th there had to be some drugs and stuff involved. I don't know why he wants something, you know, his people want to be vague or whatever the case is. But if that's what y'all want to do, that's that's what you can do. But we're going to speculate over here. So I say, let's say, what do y'all think of this, T? Do y'all think that there's a lot more going on than what has been reported? Like they said that, that people that worked at the villa found him and then they had to rush him to the hospital. Because I feel like if there was nothing drastic or crazy going on, then, um, just, you wouldn't have to take nobody to a hospital as a precautionary tale. But if Zach, look, Zach old enough to do what he do and, and be out here partying and living his best life, he in his 30s, but just everything in moderation. We don't need you ended up like Matthew Perry before you hit your 40th birthday, sir. So let me know. No, calm down a little bit. Let me know what you guys think of this story in the comments down below.